Alright folks, today we're checking out a brand new accessory tool for your gas grill, the blazing glass. Stay tuned. During the last months there weren't really many inventions that really caught me. Until I saw this. This blazing glass is high temperature resistant and it is designed to be used with your infrared grill on your gas grill. It comes with a metal part and this part is kind of the holder of your blazing glass with four screws and it's adjustable to almost any gas grill. This tool is sold by Outdoor Chef, a Swiss gas grill company, but it can be used, as I mentioned, on your Napoleon, on your Broiking, on your Weber gas grill. Almost every gas grill can have this. The only thing you need is an infrared cooking zone. Take off the grill grates, set on the metal part and then your blazing glass. Just start your burner and heat up. Everyone who's been cooking with infrared cooking zones like this knows the problems of flames, grease fires, smoke and burning. This tool will be your infrared cooking game changer, I promise. Let's get started with some steaks today. This is a ribeye, German ribeye, just salt it. We also have a sirloin steak, we sold it too. I decided to start with basic steaks, some pork french rack and some lamb chops today. But this tool will bring you more possibilities than you might have known or seen in the beginning. You are able to grill on 800 degrees celsius, first of all, but from now on it's possible to grill marinated stuff with that high temperature and this is really a game changer. You could also do it with uh, vegetables, fish and stuff, but who wants vegetables if they can grill nice steaks on that high temperature without a fat burner. The glass itself is made out of ceramic and it's perfectly designed to be used on that infrared zone. It comes with a smooth side and a ripped side, looks a little bit like a griddle. And of course we are trying both sides today. The lamp is now ready too, so let's get started with the first steak. This is the first steak I put on that blazing glass ever. I was so excited I decided to flip this one a little bit too early. You can get an idea on how good the crust could be but of course this should rest on there a little bit more. There are several ways of cleaning. First of all you can clean it with a little bit of oil and a paper towel just while grilling. And after finished grilling you just put this one in ice water. I'm not kidding. You are now able to grill a decent amount of steaks very very quickly. I place my first steak on indirect heat, add a little bit of oil on the blazing glass, the smooth side and here is the result after two or three minutes. This crust is really amazing. Looks beautiful. You can grill the steaks from all sides. And same with the other steak. I'll put it on indirect heat on my new Dual Chef Auto Chef gas grill. 80 degrees Celsius, 150 degrees Fahrenheit indirect heat until it has the internal temperature that you want. Then we flipped the plate and checked out the griddle version. And the more you use it, the better it gets. You will get a feeling of caramelization, time and temperature soon. And as soon as your French rack could look like this, place them on indirect heat too.
final try for today. Lamp chops. And these really turn out amazing too. That crust is stunning. No fat burn, no real smoke and even the heat on top, you can see it that I can just take them with my bare hands. Of course I am not sure where you are located. This tool will hit the stores in Germany end of November. The price is cool, it's about 100 euro for one of that glasses. There is a bigger one for some bigger gas grills which is 130 euros. The results really turn out good. The crust is amazing and I can wait to use this tool for more stuff. Smashed burgers, scallops, whatever. I'll keep you posted. Can't wait to hear your thoughts about that tool. Have you ever heard about that before? The blazing glass. Would that be interesting for you? I can't wait to read your comments. And of course, as always, I'm gonna slice these up and then I'm gonna give them a shot. I tried to put a link into the video description so you can check out the tool even on a German shop site. So check it out. And of course, as always, I'm gonna try all these steaks today. Delicious stuff, really, really good. So this is also a great idea for your next holiday present. If you have people who are grilling and think they all have the tools they need, here is the one that is missing. Please make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. You won't miss any other videos with blazing glass. Steaks and burgers will be next, I guess. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm out. See you.